Hey everyone, in this video, I want to quickly showcase just how fast On One Photo Raw 2023 is at completing some of the most difficult tasks photographers face when they're editing. In older versions, when it came to editing sunrises and sunsets, we would have to brush in our adjustments manually and use color range or luminosity masks to target specific subjects or areas in our photograph. And this can take up quite a bit of time, especially if you're a beginner user or you have complex subjects within your photograph. With On One Photo Raw 2023, you can now just click on a specific object or subject or region and instantly apply whatever adjustment that you're looking for. Let me show you how easy it is. So with this sunrise and sunset photograph, I first just wanna bring out some of the basic tones and warm it up a bit. So let's just quickly use AI Auto here in our tone and color pane. This is going to automatically develop the image's tone for me. You can see it's brought out a lot of that life within the scene, but it's a little bit cool still. So let's head down to our color section here and we'll just pull this temperature slider to the right and we can warm things up and make it appear much more natural. Now let's just go into the image and let's modify specific regions and subjects within it. I'm gonna hit K on my keyboard. That's going to grab me my super select AI tool. You can also select that over here in the tool well. As I hover over different regions, you can see it covers them in a red overlay. That's meaning it's detected that region and then I can select that region if I want to modify it. So let's just select all of the rocky regions and this person here. And let's apply a bit of dynamic contrast. I've selected these regions, they're overlaid in blue now, meaning they're selected. I'll just right click on the selected region and let's add in quite strong dynamic contrast, meaning it's going to bring out all of those micro textures and details. So let's just select that. And if I turn this mask off and on here, you can see it's targeting those specific regions that I selected earlier. Now let's modify the water and the sky here. I'm going to right click it and I'll just add a dark glow. Maybe not that dark, let's choose darker. There we go, darker looks awesome. So I'm gonna choose that there. And if I turn this off and on now, you can see it's strictly targeted the sky and that water there, giving it a nice, soft, hazy glow. Now let's add in a bit more color to those regions as well. I'll just select them again, right click. Let's go up to our color enhancer and let's just increase that color. I may do one last thing just by heading into the develop tab and I may just pull up on my midtones a little bit more to reveal some of those darker details within the scene. And there you have it. Incredibly easy to find and modify specific areas, regions, and subjects within your image.